Okay, so it's working now. Final version of uh, the skin for the Prime Go. Uh, this is in uh, the Mac. And this is the Prime Go. So you need to activate uh, the video, this button here. And then by holding it, you get the three screens. Okay, left, right, and the, the program out. And the fader goes with the program out window. All right. So the first step is that you have to download the Prime Go file, and it counts the downloads. Nine zero one is the time now. So we unzip it. Okay, and now you have this file. Then on Prime Go screen. Dot zip. Okay. Uh, there should be a backspace between Denon and Prime Go and screen. So you should just uh, take those away. You need to replace the, the file that is already in the skins folder. It looks exactly like this. We have to replace it. Okay, so now it's exactly how it should be. As I said, replace the original file in, um, in the skins folder, in the virtual DJ folder. And it's here, okay? How do I get here? Sometimes it's, it's a little, little bit difficult to get there. I will show you. If you go to settings and then you go to options and down in the corner you have this gear symbol. Boom. And then you get the virtual DJ folder. You go inside skins and then you have this where this original uh, then on Prime Gold screen.zip file is. I have changed it today, so I will not do that again, but I will show you how it's done. And you drag and drop it, you drag and drop it here. And it will ask you to replace it, and you choose yes, replace. But I will not do it because you just did it. Maybe you need to restart uh, uh, Virtual DJ. All right, good luck.